Hello, everyone. Welcome to another day of the Bobby, Joe, and Sheena show. Yesterday, we were talking about stop looking outside yourself. You have gifts inside. One gift that's a great gift is called judgment. And you got to catch yourself and having that awareness, the consciousness of what you're judging. Because I think, I'm going to start first today, Sheena, is that when you see something and you're judging someone, it's a gift to go, what is this saying about me? And that's what other people are, the reflections of ourselves, of what we don't like. And judgment is a tool. It's a gift. And that's a weird way to think about it. But that's how I think about it. If you listen to yesterday's episode, Sheena said that if she wants to know something that she's thinking, she'll ask Wolfgang something. And then all of a sudden, whatever he says, she'll, oh, that's a reflection of me and how I think about that. Right? Is it kind of what I, did I get that right? <laughs> take, take it away, Sheena. What do you have to say about judgment? Well, whenever there's two things that come to mind and it's judge not lest you be judged and judge righteous judgment. Now you may think, I'm here she comes again quoting the Bible, but it's just, it's actually pure science. It's pure physics. So here's the thing, you know, whatever you send out is coming right back at you. Like that's just it. We think in secret, it comes to pass. Environment is but our looking glass. So if I'm literally judging somebody and I'm going, you're, you know, you're a liar. I will absolutely guarantee you that somebody will call me that. I will absolutely guarantee it. And I have seen it with other people that the great benefit of being, of coaching other people whenever they tell you the stories and just going, I can see your pattern. Can you not see your pattern? Can you not see what's happening here? You did this and this happened and then you felt like this and then it goes round and round and round and round in circles. So Judge righteous judgment then is literally to understand that everything is the same. Now that's science based because everything is light. Everything is energy proven in science. Therefore, if you can judge that everything is exactly the same and then you put a judgment on top of it, well, why don't you just judge it to everything be the same? Now, sometimes you can say, okay, everything is God. It could be, or everything is light, or everything is energy, whatever it is that you feel comfortable with. And then move in that and just go, well, it's just energy. I feel an and So sometimes we think even being sad is wrong, or I shouldn't feel this way. No, there's a feeling going on. Just, just take away the thought that's attached to it. Feel the feeling. It's just a feeling. Let it up. Let it up and love mm -hmm. it. Don't judge it as wrong and stuff it down so it builds up, builds up, builds up, and then oh, explodes in your face. Let it up bit by bit by bit. My goodness, I could talk forever on that one because it's uh, only because, you know, experience. <laughs> of experience, I would come right back at you. <laughs> you froze for a moment there. I don't know. And we both, it says our internet's unstable, but... All I want to say is, yeah, let it up, let it up, because you know what? It's in the resistance that it's going to be the persistence, right? And when you let it up, you can heal it once and for all. Now, you don't want to be stuck there forever and be like, poor me, victim mode for five months, but let it up and love yourself. That's why you still haven't grown. You still haven't moved on to the next level is because you keep pushing the shit down, people. Let it up, heal it, love it, all right? Find that judgment about yourself, you know, that scrutinize and, you know, and it's not bad. Really love yourself. We all have flaws. Come on. It's called being a human being, people. So love ourselves where we're at. Let the shit rise and just look at it, accept it, heal it, and then send it with love. That what you resist will persist. So just love you. Don't look outside for someone to feel your love or someone to give you this or someone to give you that. It's you, baby, right from the first breath to the last breath. Nobody else. It's all you. So love on you. So judge you and love you and start having the awareness of what you're judging in your mind towards other people, knowing that what you point is coming right back at you. That's all I have for you today. Have an amazing day. I expect it for you. <laughs> See you now. <laughs>